The company itself, the philosophy is that everything can be tasted. So we've got 100 wines available on sampling machines um, so that people can try any of the wines that they want to try. The idea behind that is there are so many great wines out there. And you know, in a city like London where the selection of wines is just mind-boggling. Traditional wine merchants, you either go to a very traditional wine merchant, which can be a bit stuffy and quite difficult to, to feel comfortable, or you go to some place like Odd bins where you have a huge selection of great wines, but nobody working there really knows what's there. So the initial idea behind it was that all the staff here, we do a very small range and all the staff would know the wines. And then having found the technology available, we decided to just extend it to all the customers, knowing what's available. So the way it all works, we work on um, a system similar to an Oyster card. So you get one of our cards, uh, you put credit on it, and the credit is deducted from it as you use it. Uh, we try and keep it as accessible as possible, so any leftover credit we do give back to people and that sort of thing. But um, and the way we've laid out the shop, we've laid it out by style. Uh, so rather than doing all French wines together, uh, which gives you a huge diversity of styles all sitting next to each other, and for people who don't know wine very well, that can be quite daunting and, and quite confusing. We've broken it up a lot more like a restaurant wine list. So we put wines of a particular style together, we put all our crisp wines together. So if you do know that you like, say, a, a Bordeaux Sauvignon, which I've got on there, Chateau Renault, um, you can try the wines around it and maybe maybe find Verdejo or, or Chablis, where they're, they're different, different flavours, but stylistically quite similar. And there's a fairly good chance that if you, if you really like a Chablis, then you might, you might well like a, a, a nice crisp Verdejo as well. The idea is to try and keep it as easy as possible. So if people want to, to wander around by themselves and try by themselves, um, we're trying to give them enough information without making it mind-boggling. So, so we split by style. All of the wines come with a little information card which gives you uh, just a little bit of uh, some tasting notes, where they come from, um, the alcohol, some recommendations for the food we put them with. Uh, but with that, all the staff uh, who work for us get the chance to try all of the wines. So at any one time, you know, if, if you do want a bit of help, we are here as well. So we can, we can recommend, um, we can hopefully try and guide you or just have a chat. The, for the company and the customers, in a funny way, it's, it's the same benefits. Um, there are a few big things. One is customer satisfaction. One of the biggest results we've seen, and it sounds weird that this is a good thing from a company perspective, is that we get more returns, uh, more faulty bottles coming back. Uh, I'm very, very keen on this. Uh, people know the bottle's faulty because they tried it in the store. Um, they know what it was like when they tried it here. If it doesn't taste good when they get home, they know something's wrong. And from a, from a company point of view, this is brilliant because it means that people don't get into the head that we're selling bad wine. The second aspect is the value. Um, I feel we get to offer some very, very good value because we're not tied into brands. Um, because our best-selling grape varieties are things like Uni Blanc and Bobal and, and things that aren't hugely commercially successful in the UK, uh, the price we can get for them um, versus the quality of the wine I'm offering, very, very good. Um, whereas, and we can pass a lot of that on to the customers. So it's, it's better value for us, it's better value for the customers, we can offer a better wine for less money and still be making a reasonable margin and get the loyalty in. There is good wine out there and if we can offer the value, people will come back for it.